My name is Craig Frymond and I'm the director of Beyond the River. And Craig, what is Beyond the River? What's the story in the film? Uh, it's a story about two guys from very different uh, backgrounds who come together uh, to compete in an uh, extremely arduous canoe race <laughs> right. in South Africa called the Doozy Canoe Marathon, right. which is a 125-kilometer race, probably one of the biggest canoe races in the world. Uh, and it's a sports drama, you know, and it's about these two guys and their two lives and what they go through. It's all based on a true story. We were approached by these the real two guys which is a black guy and a white guy young black guy grew up in a sort of an informal settlement in a shack and an older white guy who's a teacher and uh, sort of at the end of his canoeing career so it's sort of got all these elements of 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 a traditional sort of sports story but it's a little bit more than that in the sense that they are both very very developed characters, very three dimensional characters, and presumably a relationship develops. Yes, the yes, yes, it does. Um, but it's equally as much a story about these two men in their two individual lives and various things that are going on in their own lives. So, so it's got the structure of a sort of a sports drama and the excitement around, I guess, that genre, but. I think that there's a film with quite a lot of depth of character, um, which sort of, for me, um, we like to say it's like Rocky with canoes. Mm. <laughs> so where was it filmed? It was filmed, um, we filmed for four weeks in Johannesburg uh, and for two weeks in KZN, uh, KwaZulu-Natal, basically from Peter Maritzburg to Durban. So this race runs from Peter Maritzburg to Durban, 120 Ks. 80 k's of paddling and 25 k's of running with a boat. Uh, it's it's uh, as I say one of I'm the more <laughs> one of the more extraordinary sporting events I've ever witnessed. And I didn't know you know when I started working in the film I didn't know much about it. I mean it's a it's like the Comrades Marathon. It's one of our big sort of sporting events. But canoeing is a, a relatively niche sport in South Africa. So. I didn't know much about it and the first time I really got introduced to it was when we went to shoot the actual race mm. in preparation for the film and it was it, it was mind blowing because it starts in Maritzburg, you know, about about hundred and twenty Ks from the sea mm. and makes its way to the mouth of of, uh, of the Omgeni River, it starts in the Duzi River, mm -hmm. crosses another river and makes its way to the sea through very, very, very rural, what they call the oh, Valley of a Thousand Hills, yeah. uh, rural KwaZulu-Natal's, you know, landscapes and Zulu villages that are pretty much untouched the way, you know, yeah. for the last, you know, 500 years. Yeah. And these, you know, this, this very sort of uh, urban cool, yeah. race yeah. <laughs> exactly <laughs> comes through these it's extraordinary yeah. actually um, and I think when I went to shoot that uh, I, I really got a sense of uh, the, the not only the visual splendor of yeah. it but the I don't know I guess just sort of the uniqueness of this race and yeah. I was like wow um, so when can we see the film? The film comes out uh, in South Africa on the 28th of April next year. Yeah. Um, and from that, uh, yeah, that's our cinema release here. Uh, and from there, I guess everything will flow from there. Yeah. Okay. And what's your next film? Um, I have a few new uh, film projects. Uh, the one is a sequel to quite a successful film that I did called Material. We're doing a mm -hmm. sequel to that. Uh, but probably the biggest film that I'm working on is a South African New Zealand co-production called The Road to Broad Bay, which is uh, loosely based on the story of Professor Sean Davison, who was involved in a very big uh, story of going to New Zealand to help his mother die. Mm.